Yo, what is going on you guys? Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to yet another Apex video. You guys are reading the title right. I just got my fourth heirloom set. Technically, this is my third heirloom set that I've earned. The Revenant one I bought. So, but I'll go over the rest of the heirlooms later on. I'm going to kind of go over who I want to give my heirloom. Two, my fourth one I should say and uh, obviously I'm playing her she's our newest legend it is Ash now I don't have too many kills with her I know I know but you know what I have the most fun with her I have the most fun with Pathfinder and I have the most fun with Revenant I don't know what it is about these robots but ah I just can't help myself at this point mm. I know we're going on season 12 here in just a couple days time, but I don't know. We'll see what kind of legends come out after, but honestly, I'm kind of set on getting Ashes, honestly. I'm having a blast with her. It's gonna, it's kind of tied between Ash and Horizon though, honestly, because I still want to get Horizons if Horizon ever gets hers, but. From what the data miners have been finding over there on YouTube that I've been keeping up with, uh, more than likely Crypto is going to be the next legend to get his. So, it kind of makes me think, you know. I don't know. Because getting your heirloom shards is very hard to get. Now, before it was like a zero point bunch of zeros, one <laughs> percent. So it was like 0 0.000000001 and you could get your heirloom. Well now they set it up to where you open up 500 Apex packs, if not more, and you can get an heirloom. Well, for me and for a bunch of my other friends, not even just content creator friends, they still haven't even gotten their heirloom shards and they've been playing for just as long as I have. So, And then I had another friend who's been playing the game since day one, three years ago, and uh, he made an alt account on his PC, and literally two days later, he got his heirloom. He got an heirloom set, so... I don't know. I kind of feel like it's botched, honestly, getting heirlooms, but here it is, you guys. Technically, it is my fourth heirloom set. Oh, man. Now when this when I opened this Apex pack, I had no intention of getting an heirloom. I just got off of like a 12 hour shift from my job and I just decided, you know what, I'm gonna play a little Apex, just kinda dick around with a few peeps and just have some fun tonight. And then this happened, so yeah. <laughs> I don't know what to do with it. What do you guys think? I want to hear you guys' opinions down in the comments below. Like, don't get me wrong. I'm very happy I got another heirloom set. It's going to be very cool to uh, get it. But I kind of want to give it to a few other people. And I don't think I can. Once it's on my account, I don't think I can transfer it. So, it is what it is. But right here, I'll show you guys. So, here's Bloodhounds. As you can see, I don't have too many kills with him. Here's Pathies, the one you guys chose for me, which I absolutely love. Mm. Such a good heirloom. And then for my mains, who I'm gonna be retiring here soon, I have Revenant. Mm, badass. So it just kind of leaves the option like, do I want to spend this heirloom set on Ash or do I want to spend it on Horizon? Because like I said before, who is it? Crypto? Yeah. He's going to be getting his heirloom in season 12 because, yeah, they need to give Cryptos already. I mean, I do like both Wraith and, oh god, Octanes? Yeah. But I don't know. But yeah, right here, here is my next set. And here are the current ones that are out. And I don't play too much of Raid or Octane. I play Mirage more than I do the both of them. But even still, I just want to get... I don't know. It's interesting. Hmm. 
I don't know. I think it's just kind of funny how I got my fourth one. So let me know you guys' thoughts down in the comments below. Do you guys think I should hold off for Ash, or do you guys think I should hold off for Horizon whenever either one get theirs? Because apparently I'm god tier lucky in this game. Should I just get Horizons and then hope I get another one for Ash? I don't know. Or should I do it vice versa? Surprise and we'll get hers first. Let me know your thoughts down in the comments below. I hope you guys enjoyed this quick little video. This is your boy Bebop Gaming, and I will catch you guys in the next one. Thanks for tuning in. Bye!